If you could be any character from a romantic book or movie, who would it be? Oh, for me, I get to be easy because I believe that The Princess Bride is also a romance movie and I would be Wesley or better yet, the Dread Pirate Roberts. He goes to the fire swamp to rescue his, his thing. He comes back from the dead. How much more romance do you need to get? <laughs> See, I would choose Elizabeth Bennet from Pride and Prejudice. She gets Darcy. Mr. Darcy. But are those romance movies? Yes. Those are... Those aren't romance romance movies, are they? Well, of course, I can't really complain. I'm yes, sitting here using. Yes, they are. I'm sitting here complaining about yours not being a romance movie as I chose The Princess Bride. So right. <laughs> I don't think I have any room to throw stuff on there. Even though maybe there's a discussion about what exactly is a romance movie. Because I don't think Titanic is a romance movie, but apparently all of the women in the planet think I'm wrong. So You are wrong. <laughs> so there's that. <laughs> Maybe I just don't know what's romantic in a movie. Maybe there's that option for me. I don't know when someone's flirting with me, so why would I know what the heck's romantic in a movie? Even though, oddly enough, if I had to think of a, a romantic movie that I actually quasi liked, it would have been Fifty First State. Ah, uh, that's a great one. Yeah, that's a guy romantic flick. Yeah, I guess so. If there's going to be one. And, and there's probably a couple others that I just slipped my mind. I'm not a big movie person. But. Well, you hit the majors. You hit Titanic. Titanic's not a. Anyway, we're not going to go into Titanic here. I get in trouble every time we discuss <laughs> Titanic. <laughs> so we're not going to discuss the Titanic here. But. <sighs> It's what is a romance movie, I guess, is actually a good question. Because I think a lot of the romance movies, and they seem a little creepy to me. A little creepy? A little creepy. The people in it are, they're just a little... If they were real life, some of these people would be in jail. They wouldn't get the girl at the end. That's just all I'm saying. Mm. There can be a little stalkerish. Not even necessarily romance movies. Movies like Mrs. Doubtfire. You go in and you dress up as a... As, you know, you can understand as a father, as you know, who's kind of been through that whole divorce thing. I can kind of understand the emotional get to it. And so I'm not going to make a big deal about it. But It was a movie. Yeah, again, it's a movie. But if you think about it too hard, it's a little creepy. It's a little creepy. And a lot of romance movies are like that. If you think about it a little too hard... It's a little creepy, and you know me. What happens? I think about things a little too hard. It's just the <laughs> nature of the beast. So if you want to enjoy a romance movie, I do have a tip for you. Don't think about it too hard. Just enjoy it like a piece of bubblegum. And that is your daily dose of love.